I mean, I've got a good feeling about that. You did very well there. <laughs> take great. one. It's take one as well. Well, it's time for another You in Two, and I'm honoured to have been invited into the home of Tom Scudamore. Tom, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Uh, absolute pleasure to be here with you. I've just heard a fantastic interview with Tom and Ollie Bell that you can hear on sportinglife.com very soon. Right, it's time for You in Two. The idea is answer as many questions about your own career in two minutes. So Joe Tizard has kind of set the standard. He answered 13 in the two minutes-ish. It was questionable. Um, Harry Cobden's on nine, so is Daryl Jacob. So okay. as, you're long, aiming... as long as I beat those two, I don't mind, especially Jacob. Okay, okay. <laughs> right. right, let's see how you do. All about your own career and your family. So, right, okay. you know, you should know the answers to that. <laughs> I should do. There we go. Okay, are we ready on the timer? On which horse did you beat Denman in the 2009? Madison de That's right. At which course have you ridden the most winners? Newton Abbott. That's right, 89. How many winners had you ridden for John Joe O'Neill prior to the cloth cap? Big round number, none. That's right. Who were your two grade one winners at the 2014 Cheltenham Festival? Uh, Western War Horse and Dinner. That's right, one of those was Spotlight Michael. At which track did you ride View Lion Rouge on his bumper debut in December 2012? Bossless. That's right. On which horse did you win the 2007 Ida Chase? Neil Desperand. That's right. Who was second when you won the 2009 National Sprint Hurdle on Vision de Flow? Two, uh, 2009? 2019, 19, sorry. Yeah. Okay, um, Noel Feely on If the Cat Fit. That's right, yeah. By how many lengths did Thistlecrack win the Grade 1 Sefton Novices Hurdle at Aintree in 2015? Uh, 18. 13. Oh. Uh, in which year did you turn professional? Uh, 2001. Who did you ride as an amateur in the 2001 Grand National? Golden Starlight. Which sh Shantou Gelding did you ride to win by 19 lengths at Warwick on his debut that for the Pipe? That's right. Untempt Port 2 won the Ultima Handicap Chase twice. First from a mark of 148 in 2016, but what was his official rating when winning the following season? 157. Oh, 155. Ooh. How many times was your dad champion jockey? Uh, seven times on his own, once shared. Eight all in. Eight, yeah, we'll take that answer. <laughs> on which grey, who was not for five at Cheltenham, did you win races at Carlisle, Lingfield, Newbury, Bangor, Wincanton, Aintree? Chevrolet, Chambertin. That's right. And last question, on which horse did your grandfather win the Sporting Life Arc or having never jumped Greek over fences? That's right, <laughs> that was the final question. Are we, how are we for time? We've got four seconds. Left. Four seconds? Have so I we'll do... <laughs> I, be I believe so. Time? We're, we're filling, yeah, so time is done. Time's done. Time is done. I mean, I've got a good feeling about that. You did very <laughs> well there. Four take three. one, it's take one as well. You've got 13. 13? 13. 13. You've equaled Joe oh, Tizard. Very good. Um, Excellent. I wish I had another question to try, but I don't. So, well done. With four seconds to spare, we will add that as an Excellent. asterisk Thank you. on the leaderboard. <laughs> Thank you. Um, you are level at the top with Joe Tizard. Thank you well very done, much. Well done, Tom Scudamore. Unbelievable. Table is on <laughs> screen now. Congratulations. Thank you. Table is on screen now. For more content like this, head over to sportinglife.com or the Sporting Life YouTube channel for fantastic interviews with the likes of Tom Scudamore, Harry Cobden, Joe Tizard, among many others.